Welcome back to the same spot we were last time, but with a different computer, same pants, same kitty, and my wife. Hi. Yay. Okay, so we're going to be upgrading her computer now, so that involves pretty much the same thing. Take the screws out, remove old HHD, put into toaster, toast, and put in the new freshly toasted SSD. Um, so yeah, let's get on that. Okay, now that I took out all the screws, which are right over here, take a sharp pointy object, and yeah, there we go. So, looks like we have... Oh, that's cool. Okay, I was thinking that it only had... Well, that it had two RAM card slot things. So this only has four gigabytes of RAM. So another four gigabytes would probably do it pretty well. Um, and those are, those are cheap, so we'll definitely have to upgrade one of those. And it's super nice, because I won't have to move very far to get this thing out. Because uh, that's right there. So yeah, that's the next step, getting this thing out. Okay, uh, this one took me a bit to figure out. Um, so I was looking around for any sort of pins or something that I could pull this up with, or uh, screws to unscrew, there's a couple right there and right there. But, no, there's none of that. Um, instead, what you do is you take Mr. Pull Tab, and you pull like that. And it's out. Just like that. That is really simple. Nice, quick, and easy, and I, I like that, actually. So, uh, so, we're gonna go about putting in that. Well, actually, no. First, before we put in the SSD, we want to make sure that all the information on this is in toaster, SSD, computer. That's the process here, so let's do that. Okay, so here we go. Da, da. Take you out, and now we are going to put that into, let me check. Yep, we're gonna put it right into here. This is the disc to be cloned, sir. Yep, disc to be clones. It spins up, you can hear it there. And this is the disc to clone it to. Uh, yes, it goes this way. Yep. Sorry for the shaky footage. Okay, and now you hold down this button for 10 seconds and let the magic happen. You'll see the light change. You'll see the light change. Please. Please. Is it changing? I think that was 10 seconds. Okay, so common problem. The one terabyte hard drive is larger than the 500 gigabyte SSD. So, I'm gonna have to put in some software to change the partitions on that so that it'll accept it. And that'll be fun, so I'll figure that out. Oof. This is gonna take a while. I had to do it differently. So, yeah. Four hours, 30 minutes later. Yay! Okay, that finally finished. It took four hours and 38 minutes, which was a lifetime in computer years. So we're just gonna go back right to what we were doing. Uh, pull this out with a little slidey. I only put in two screws just to save some time. I thought it'd be nice and handy. This is a little toasty. Uh, won't be toasty for too much longer because it's gonna go into hard drive retirement home, I think. We might still use it. We'll see though. So I'm gonna unscrew this, put this one in, which should have everything now. And, yeah, we'll see how fast it boots after that. Okay, the solid state drive is installed. Um, now before, this was a terabyte hard drive. This is a 500 gigabyte hard drive. My wife's gonna use this as like a backup external hard drive. And this is gonna be the main one she uses. We still have room for another, uh, memory stick, another, uh, well, not another, but we have room for M2 SATA. We'll get those eventually next time I open up this panel. Those are the next two things that are going in it. Now, with this type of setup, going from a terabyte hard drive to a smaller solid state drive, um, from terabyte to 500 gigabyte, um, this dock doesn't really like it. So what I had to do, and what made it take so much longer, was I had to ex install a program that um, basically 
um, partitions all of the stuff on the hard drive to a certain area to make it appear like it had enough room to fit onto here, which it does. There was only like 100 gigabytes on there, but it was just saying, hey, I don't think I fit because this is a pretty simple thing, so it wasn't really thinking about that. It was just like, oh, there's a terabyte here, there's 500 gigabytes here, it's not going to work. But yeah, this program just basically said, yeah, it will work and it'll work like this. Uh, so now, that being said, we're going to have a little moment of truth here. We're going to install this panel. Um, we're going to get my wife back over here, and we're going to load this up. Alright, let's see how fast this thing boots up. Okay, moment of truth. Uh-huh, Acer, good. Uh-huh. It's spinning. Good job, Circle. Doing great. Please go faster. Oh, thank you for the meow. We're starting up in several seconds. That was... Oh. That is very That's fast. That's five seconds. Good job. Okay, computer is on. Too fast for me! Good job, computer. <laughs> I know, it's like it's on... Oh, you killed my mouse. ...cocaine. Oh, I'm sorry, mouse. No, oh, it should be ready now. Let's try wiggling Steam it. Steam, don't let us down. Oh, now it's working. Yeah, I made it work. <laughs> Go me. Come on, Steam. <sighs> You're a little disappointing. Oh. I think it has to connect to the internet, it's the thing, but yeah. <laughs> Launching Fallout Shelter. Go! <laughs> This used to be a feature of the channel. That's pretty fun. It's a good game. Mm. And quick vault tour of Michelle's vault. Yeah. <laughs> we have to sing while we wait. Ba -da -ba -da -da, ba -da. Hey. <laughs> Come on, SSD card. <laughs> so this takes the same amount. Uh, okay. Yeah, it does. <laughs> okay. That's pretty cool. Nice job. Seems like it's not, not going slow or anything. Okay. That works pretty nice. Before it was just dragging by, right? It was... Yeah, sometimes. Had like frame rates dropping and all sorts of stuff like that. Okay. What's that sound? Crickets. Oh. Very nice vault. 10 out of 10. What are you working on right now in your vault? Uh, nothing in particular really. Just topping off everyone's specials. Ah. Alright. Well, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed this quick little. <laughs> uh, tech update video. Uh, next time you'll see us doing something similar to this. We'll be installing again the M2 SATAs and <laughs> memory. Oh no! Crisis! Alright, we'll deal with this and hope you guys have a good day. <laughs> Bye now!